The snapping turtle family is split into two groups, common snapping turtles and alligator snapping turtles. Snapping turtles may also be related to the similar looking Asiatic big-headed turtles. However, as of this recording, the two families are separated, but this could change in the future as more information becomes available. Common snapping turtles and alligator snapping turtles are often confused because they look similar to one another. Common snapping turtles are generally more round, while alligator snapping turtles are more angular. Alligator snapping turtles are also much larger in size, have a more pointed beak, and are more nocturnal than common snapping turtles. Common snapping turtles range from North America to Northern South America, while alligator snapping turtles are more confined to the southeastern region of the US. Both groups can be found in just about any type of freshwater system, but they prefer slow-moving or stagnant waters that are relatively shallow, have muddy or sandy bottoms, and have plenty of vegetation for hiding. Snapping turtles are largely aquatic animals. Alligator snappers are sedentary and spend nearly all of their time in water, leaving only to build a nest on land as close to the water as they can get it without risk of flooding. Common snapping turtles spend a great deal of their time in water too, but more often move across land either to find a new pond or look for an appropriate nest site. This is when common snapping turtles are most often seen by people. The biggest threat to an adult snapping turtle is a human. These turtles may be hit by cars or caught for use in food. Young snapping turtles and snapping turtle eggs are more vulnerable to being taken by possums, foxes, raccoons, crows, and more. The breeding season for snapping turtles can differ based on how far north the turtles are living, but it generally occurs between March and October. These turtles are mostly solitary in nature, but will begin meeting up with other individuals after they reach four years of age. Female snapping turtles are able to store sperm, so they don't even need to meet up with a male every year in order to produce fertilized eggs. Female snapping turtles will pull themselves out of the water and dig a nest in the ground. Here, they'll lay anywhere from fewer than 10 to more than 80 eggs. The eggs will take 2 to 4 months to hatch, with the hatchlings possibly staying in the nest to overwinter, just like the pond sliders we've previously discussed. In size, alligator snapping turtles take the top spot for largest freshwater turtles in America. They range from 1 to more than 2.5 feet in length, not including their tails, which can be as long as their shells. They also weigh from 35 to more than 150 pounds. At the rate things are going for the largest freshwater turtles in the world, alligator snappers may take over that label within our lifetimes. Common snapping turtles are smaller, but still impressive, averaging a foot in length and 20 pounds in weight. To get that big, these turtles eat invertebrates, carrion, fish, birds, small mammals, and aquatic vegetation, with alligator snappers also taking other turtles and even small alligators. Alligator snapping turtles are sit-and-wait predators. They'll hold their mouths open and wriggle a lure on their tongues that looks like a worm. This attracts prey, who get snapped up in an instant. Common snapping turtles are more active hunters. During cooler months, these turtles may go into a state of low activity sometimes, even using beaver lodges as temporary homes. If they can avoid predation, snapping turtles may live to be 30 years old in the wild. For more facts on snapping turtles, check out the links in the description. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today, and thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.